All the time we are looking for some ways how to improve the speed of processing time. As you could know, importing and exporting stage sometimes takes a lot of time. In Cyclone Registry 360 we can run some operations through command line interface to automate processing steps. All that you need to do is type which settings for each step you want to apply and click enter button. The Cyclone Register 360 will do all operations in the background one by one without user interactions. That approach could significantly improve the speed of data processing in some specific scenarios. To be able to run the Cyclone Register 360 through command line interface, you should have the Cyclone workflow or Publisher Pro license on your PC. And some commands are not available in Register 360 BLK Edition. To check all options and the latest updates, you can go to the online help page for Register 360. At the moment, the below scenarios are available. Convert RTC and BLK 360 raw data to E57 format and convert BLK to Go, BLK Arc and BLK to Fly data to LGS, E57 and RAW formats. When you run any of that process, you can add specific settings like merging all E57 files to one single file after processing or extracting rectified images from B2G files. To check all available comments, go to the same online help page for Register360. Here's an example of data processing for RTC360 to E57. First, put all raw data into separate folder. Run the CMD. Change the default path to the installation directory of Cyclone Register 360. By default, it's C program files like a system Cyclone Register 360. Type the below commands register360.exe to run the software and uh, regexp2e57 to run a specific process. Include the path to the staging folder. If the staging folder path contains spaces, then quotes must be included at the beginning and end of the path. Specify would you like to delete project in register 360 after processing will be done or no. Type delete project yes or no. Define resolution for panoramic images. And specify would you like to merge all E57 files to one single file, yes or no. So here's an example of the full code. Then just click enter to start the process. If you're processing RTC data, then your field 360 and VIS information will be used for registration. But if you work with BLK360 G1 data, it will be processed through AutoCloud for registration. Cyclone Field 360 linking is not supported for BLK360 G1 data, because due to the fact that Cyclone Field 360 links are stored exclusively on the tablet. With the latest updates of Field 360, you can create additional links and close your loops which will guarantee you correct registration. And to be sure that everything was done fine, you can open the project and register 360 and check the accuracy for registration. So as the final result, you will get a registered point cloud in E57 format with desired settings. A text file showing the registration result will be written to the user specified staging folder. It's the easiest scenario for data processing, which include import, image generation, point cloud colorization, registering and publishing stages. But for autonomous scanners like Bilky to go Bilky to fly and Bilky arcs, scenarios could be more complex with additional file types generation, like rectified images or separate point cloud which will represent the trajectory of the scanner. Each format type for the final deliverable includes its own features and commands. For example, if you will choose to convert B2G file to E57 format, you can specify a folder for export. But for other types of format, that option is not available. If you will choose to convert B2G file to LGS format, you can specify what types of information that file should include. You can add pano image point cloud ability to make measurements on panoramic images, etc. But for other types of formats, these options will not apply any effect. To make your life easier, register 360, remember which last settings for importing B2G files you used before and use them as a default setting. So you can open your register 360, add B2G file for import, define settings such as waypoint intervals and waypoint from geotech locations, close register 360 without importing the data. Settings that you selected will be used while processing through the command line interface. Also keep in mind that if you work in the like 
encourage the 360 build key edition, you should specify another path in the command line interface and another starting application name. Here's an example of converting B2G file through register 360 to LJS format. For me, it was interesting how to generate a BAT file from that line of comments to be able to run it anytime I want just with double click on it without specifying each time all these comments and changing the path for running the application. So I decided to ask ChatGPT generate code for me with instructions because I have no idea how to do that kind of files. ChatGPT provide me with detailed instructions and examples on how to do that. I realize that it's much easier than you thought. You just need to add a few additional comments to your text and save it as a file with the bot extension. Next, you can run it with double click on it and it will automatically run all specified processes. As you could imagine, it could be not so easy to remember all variations and all available comments to generate that files. That's why I asked ChatGPT to write for me a code for my site with a text generator based on user selected options. After a few unsuccessful attempts, it gives me a working code. Below you can find two versions of the text generator. The first version of the text generator is suitable for converting RTC and BLT 360 data to E57 format with below options. Input path to your raw data folder. Insert here path on your computer to the folder where raw data from RTC or BLK360 is located. Delete the project and register 360 after processing will be done. If you would like to check the accuracy of registering, set this value to no and you will be able to open that project and register 360. Resolution for panoramic images. RTC captures all images by default with 5K resolution. Here you can define which resolution you would like to get after processing. Merge all E57 into one single file. Set this value to yes if you would like to group all scans. As a result, you can generate text which you should insert into your command line and generate a path file, which you can run with a double click and start the process. The second version of Text Generator is suitable for converting B2G files to LGS, E57 and RAW formats with the below options. Select software version, register 360 or register 360 BLK edition. Select which type format you would like to generate, E57, LGS or RAW. Input path for the raw data folder, input path for the export data folder, that option available only for E57 files. Option for generating rectified images, that's option relevant only for if E57 files as well. Specify interval for generating waypoints, you should input here just a number in meters. Option for generating waypoints from geotech positions. Option include point cloud into the file, that's uh, relevant only for LGS files, as well as panoramic image and measurement ability. Delete project and register 360 after processing will be done and align coordinate system for point cloud based on the longest wall in your scene. As in a previous example, uh, as a final result, you can generate a text which you should insert to your command line or you can generate BAT file and download it. If you double click on it, the process will start automatically.